What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another Fallout 76 video and today I'm bringing you an unlimited XP bottle cap and material glitch for Fallout 76. Now with this glitch you're going to be getting thousands and thousands of XP per hour and over 50,000 bottle caps per hour guys which is just absolutely ridiculous. Now this glitch was actually shown to me by one of my friends but he said he would like to remain anonymous in the video but use this glitch at your own risk guys because it can cause your game to crash and make it a little bit unstable so kind of keep that in mind and don't go too overboard with it but if you guys do go on to enjoy the video or just find helpful make sure you like subscribe and let's get right into it all right everybody so to do this glitch you do not need anything and you can do this at any level but you are going to have to be looking for the quest battle bot now it can be located up by the mount blair train yard and go ahead and just hang out here if you server hop you can kind of find it most times when you go in here i could say about 90 percent of the time you're gonna find it so when you come here, there is going to be a sentry bot that you're going to have to kill or just follow. Um, it's faster if you go ahead and kill him just because the faster you can get this quest done, the faster you can do it again, and the faster you're going to get XP and bottle caps. So if you are a lower level, he can take a little bit to kill. I killed him at like level 5 on my other character, and it wasn't really that hard. It just took a little bit. Um, but once you kill him, it's actually going to update the quest, and you're going to want to make your way back over to this like little shack here with these blue doors. Through these doors, there are going to be two Mr. Gutsies that you need to take out, and what they are holding is actually the key cards that you need to progress in this quest. You need two, and both of them are holding one, so once you have collected both of them, the quest should progress, and you will now need to actually activate both of them. So, it's kind of like a timed mission. Set yourself upright so you can run around and activate both key cards before the time is over. If you don't get it in time, you can just go ahead and try it as many times as you need to until you can get it, but once you're at this part, this is where the glitch comes into play. Now, to actually complete this quest, there is this thing over here called the Master Shutdown button, and once you press that, it's going to complete the quest and give you your awards, but when you're actually pressing this, it is going to let you press it several times, and every time you press that button, it is going to say that you completed that quest. So if you press it four times, you're going to get four times the rewards you would normally get. If you press it a hundred times, it's going to give you a hundred times the reward it gets. If you're on PC, I highly recommend that you set up a macro for either your keyboard or mouse so that you can have it press it over like a hundred times per second faster than you would ever be able to. But if you hold a macro on here, make sure that you don't do it any longer than about like five to seven seconds just because it will make your game crash. Your game won't crash every time. For me, it did not crash here. But if yours does happen to crash, just go ahead and load back into your game and you will see all your rewards. If you are on a team, only one person person has to do this and everybody in the area will get the XP rewards so you can do this as a team as well which is always great but as you can see once you start getting your rewards it is just absolutely crazy how much you actually get if you remember I started about 8,800 bottle caps and now I'm at 9,661 so nearly 1,000 bottle caps from that actual run right there and I'm almost a full level ahead and I'm level 91 so you can see how much XP you actually get from this. And in all honesty this is one of like my worst runs on here. You can get really lucky and get up to like four levels at a time and get a ton of XP and money and everything like that and then sometimes you'll get a like a lesser run where you maybe only get 300 bottle caps. But right here, I'm actually just going through all the different materials you get. You get a ton of purified water, rat away, stim packs, and then for weapons, you get a whole bunch of Gatlin lasers, drills, fat mans, missile launchers, and a whole bunch of ammo to go with those as well. So for armor, you actually do get some good stuff here. I got an auto sim combat armor chest piece, and that's pretty much what you get here is either combat armor or metal armor. But the legendary effects you get on them actually can be pretty beneficial for you. You will certainly be overcumbered whenever you finish this glitch, so I would recommend putting your camp across the road. It's a very short walk, so you can just go over there, scrap all the items that you don't need to get those modifications that you've been wanting, or do whatever with them. Now, once you have done this quest and you want to do it again, go ahead and leave your server and load into a new one. Bethesda says that they fixed server hopping, but I actually server hopped to do this glitch. If you fast travel somewhere else and kind of do something for maybe five minutes and go back to that location, the actual quest is going to be respawned in there again for you to do. Now, whenever you scrap all of your items, you actually do get a ton of scrap as well. Whenever you scrap the Gatlin lasers that you can get, you actually get plastic from these. So you can get some really good rare materials here. But other than that, that's pretty much how you do this glitch, guys. It's really simple. Um, I'm sure this glitch is going to get patched super, super fast. So if you want to try it, I recommend trying it fast because the duplication glitch only lasted about 18 hours. So Bethesda is actually getting on their stuff about patching glitches, guys. So if at any point in this video you did enjoy it or just found it helpful, make sure you like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.